This episode of Kitchen Courses was brought to you by Swanson. Welcome to Kitchen Courses, where you are the pro in your own kitchen. Hi, I'm Chef Marcus Ford, and today we're making that mouth-watering seasonal favorite, braised beef short ribs. This one will take some time, so cozy up for a day of home cooking that will have your house smelling as savory as your dinner. Here's what you'll need to get started. Three and a half pounds of boneless beef short ribs, trimmed of any excess fat if possible, some kosher salt and coarse ground black pepper, two tablespoons of vegetable oil, two large onions peeled, halved, and sliced, one tablespoon of tomato paste, six cloves of garlic, peeled but kept whole, two cups of red wine, two cups of Swanson beef broth, four large carrots peeled, cut into three inch pieces, four sprigs of fresh thyme, one bay leaf, and a quarter cup of cold water. Turn your oven to 350 degrees and adjust the rack to the center. Then you have your beef short ribs. You can purchase them boneless. You can remove the bone yourself, or you can do what I've done and make friends with the butcher. Have him take care of it for you. Generously salt and pepper your three and a half pounds of beef short ribs on each side. Take a little bit of oil, add it to the pot, and then you're gonna sear the ribs fat side down first. Do about half of the ribs at a time so the pot doesn't cool off. Sear on each side so it's a nice brown color, then flip. Do this until all the meat is brown on all four sides. Now our beef has plenty of color. We want to add in our onions. For this recipe, I've chosen to mix red and white and let that cook for 12 to 15 minutes covered until your onions are nice and tender. Add your carrots, your garlic, one to two bay leaves, fresh sprigs of thyme. Don't worry about chopping it because you're gonna pull these out later. Your tomato paste, right into the pot. Our Swanson beef broth. And finally, two cups of red wine. A good dry red wine. Bring this up to a boil with the cover on. Turn the fire off. Put this into your preheated oven at 350 degrees for two and a half hours, turning the meat at least twice during your cooking. Serve these amazing beef short ribs with some seasonal root vegetables and Yukon gold potatoes, or another garden-sized waxy spud. I'm Chef Marcus Ford, and this is Kitchen Horses.